you want to scrape Google SERP, I will show you how to do that in one click with through. Through is a free SERP analyzer. With through, you will get all insight about pages on the Google search. You will get a lot of on-page information for your SEO and copywriting. Let's get started. If you click on scrape here, you will open the scrape panel, quite similar to the existing version. If you click here, you can display uh, and hide the filter. So same, uh, same filtering. You can uh, search for location, country, search engine, language, number of page uh, or results you want to scrape up to 100, desktop or mobile. This is something new here. You can as well include, uh, I mean, it includes a page performance if you like. So it will analyze the page speed and uh, other information and also something quite uh, helpful i guess you know you can save your filter and so next time you scrape the same serp you can just switch between filters so let me show you how it works so i will search for through in on the us serp click on scrape the serp so now through is going uh yeah you see it's quite fast it's faster than the previous version um, all right, so then, so here you have the first panel. So here it has been, it has been improved. You can see some SERP uh, insights, number of results, what kind of uh, SERP features are available. So knowledge graph, answer box, feature snippet, FAQ or not, number of words, number of images, and also when was the last update performed, etc. You can download the SERP directly from here. You don't have to scroll down. Uh, as it was in the previous version. Also, the view has changed a bit. So here you can see uh, different tabs. We will go through them uh, soon. But first, let's focus on the result uh, view. So here, these are the new view of, of through. So when you click on a page, it will open directly a panel and you can see some page information. So let's move on. Here you can see uh, well, um, the title, meta description, some page information, and as well something nice. You can now also have directly um, the table of content. All right, so, so what you can see here, this little um, tag or uh, information here, you can see uh, directly w w what page is the shortest one, the one with the least image, the last updated, and so on. You can also directly from here filter. So you can also first filter on different results if you want only to display the organic pages or, res or, or the organic results or, um, or the paid or all. And then you can, let's say I will show you only the organic, page, organic pages and filter by word count. Okay, so now I have here the longest one and second longest, etc. And you can do that the same for different uh, parameter. Also here, so there is two view now for the result, the card view, which is, let's say, a nice view uh, where you can get um, on-page information for every pages. And the table view, that uh, here you can have a view of the main information of the SERP, so number of words, images, publication date, long, uh, long uh, links, uh, schema, performance, and uh, speed. And so, for instance, here you can also directly see which one is the longest one, etc. Okay, and by the way, if you display or if you scrape more than 10, you can also display all. I by default only display the 10 first, but you can go here and display more results. Great, so now next tab, title. You might know this one as well, the title tab. So here you have all the titles next to each other with the keyword frequency. Same for the headings, heading one next to each other with keyword frequency. Heading two, so here's something new. I group each H2 uh, of the first 10 pages by position on the page. So what does it mean? In section one, I group all the H2, all the first H, H2 of each page. In section two, I group all the second H2 of each page, etc. You understand the idea? And here you can see a number of sections in average. As well, description here, so you can see uh, you have a focus on the description and you can see the comparison between the SERP, so what Google display 
and what you or what uh, the website owner enter in the description for his uh, in the meta description. And here next week, next week you have the, um, some keyword frequency for the SERP and on page. Great related search as well display here. Depending on the SERP, you will have more tabs. I'm displaying as well local pack, um, news, video, and so on. So just scrape and you will see more data. Um, yeah, so you can download here uh, the file, the Excel file. And also if you go here now, you have a menu. So there will be more features coming as well. And the new feature will be available right there. If you click on history now, I keeping the history of yourself. So yes, if you want to, uh, if you did a research uh, yesterday, you can have a look and check what you have done. You can also download your previous uh, uh, SERP uh, uh, scrape. All right, so here, let's see what I've done. So I click on view and um, and as well, yeah, so you can see, you can see uh, yeah, previous uh, SERP. And let me show you something as well. So for the performances, so I will just search one. So here I have the page performance for this one. So I want to show you that. So when you run a uh, scrape with a page performance, be aware that it will take more time because yeah, there is more uh, process in the background to perform. So here, so when you when you have the when you have the performance uh, uh, um, uh, checked, so here you have a new tab performance, and here you can see overview of the SERP displaying the page performance. So for each page, you have the performance, the, spe the speed index, and also different uh, core web vitals uh, parameter or signals, uh, and also as well the um, Chrome user uh, uh, Chrome user experience report, yeah, something like this. All right, um, yes, so you can see all the performance and as well for each result, you can see also here some information. I hope you enjoy watching this review of through. If you want to try through today, check the description below. We'll find every link to create an account and try through today. Let's create the SERP.